Hey there folks, Paul Markle from Student of the Gun, and today we're going to do a Battle Box unboxing video. Yes, indeed. And today's is Mission 91. That's right, there's been 90 before this, and this is Mission 91. Alright, well, before I uh, turn the camera on, I, I cut the tape so it would be really easy to open the box. B-I-N-G-O, and this is a Pro Plus. This is Mission 91 Pro Plus. So what do you always have in there? Well, you have your Mission Brief. So let's go ahead and take a look at it. Mission Brief, Mission 91. It's time for Mission 91 of Battle Box. Fall is on the horizon, and we hope you have plans to get outdoors as the weather cools off and the season presents new adventures and possibilities. Yeehaw! All right, so... What's the first thing we've got in the basic kit? The basic box looks like it is a Peak Refuel Titanium Spoon. Let's find that guy. All right, there it is. And as somebody who's eaten uh, many, many, many meals in the out of doors, I can appreciate something like this. You will never catch a seasoned combat veteran in the field without a spare spoon. And so this is kind of a spoon spork kind of a dealio here. Titanium, so it's super lightweight. So there we go, that's from Peak Refuel Titanium Spoon. And of course, well, they gotta give you something to eat. So Peak Refuel Biscuits and Gravy, freeze dried. This is two servings, so it can feed you and a buddy, or you for breakfast and you for lunch, or maybe you're just a fat boy and you need, like to eat lots of biscuits and gravy. And uh, this is one of those, you know, boil and eat things. You open it, boil the water, put it in there, eat it with your spoon. There we go. Biscuits and gravy from Peak Refuel. Pretty cool. All right. So we got the food. We got the spoon. That's always a good thing. What's next? Gear Aid Fast Acting Cooling Towel. All right. So here we go. And I have not taken this out of the packaging yet, so we'll go ahead and take it out of the packaging. Open it up, and uh, whoop, there we go. Cooling towel. Take that out. So it looks like it's got a little storage pouch here for it. And there you go. There you go. Uh, like a little Shimog type deal. Uh, it's even got a. It's got a tie down here. It's got a snap tie down. So I guess you could hook it through here. Fast acting cooling towel when it's hot to dry the sweat off your face and so on and so forth. And fast drying. I guess you could also use this like a, this like a little mini shimog or whatever. Tuck it up in there. It's always good to have some type of a bandana or a towel or whatever. And this is a super lightweight one. And uh, it won't take up a lot of room in your pack. And it probably, I'm assuming, dry really fast. So there you go. This is from... Gear Aid. So there you go. Put that in the pouch. Set that aside. What's next? What's next? I'm kind of excited about this next one. The Humvee Folding Shovel. All right. All right. Humvee Folding Shovel. Folding Pack Shovel. This is something that a lot of people neglect because shovels aren't quite as cool as guns and ammo and, and you know, custom knives and so forth. But if you're going to be out in the field, in the woods, uh, or in the desert, or in the jungle, or anywhere, you really need a good folding uh, tool, an e-tool, an entrenching tool. And this one looks to be a very solid entrenching tool. So I'm assuming that what I'm going to do here is twist this in some form or fashion. I've never used one of these. Okay, here we go. There we go. Twist, twist, twist. There we go. Twisted. I'm twisting. Right, so in order to tighten it, I was twisting it counterclockwise. So we got a handle here. And then of course, like most e-tools, pretty much every e-tool, unless it's a solid one, what you'll do, if you want to use it as like a hoe, you can lock it down and grab and scoop. And it's got a little saw blade there. Not too sharp, but might help you. And that's neat. It's got a little, oh, a nail puller or saw, a sawtooth. So uh, this seems to be a very sturdy 
a uh, very sturdy piece of gear. So there we go. Folds up, comes with a pouch that has a belt slot on it. And if you're going to be camping or if you're going to be hiking, if you're going to be in the woods or whatever, you need a good e-tool. This one is from Humvee. There you go. So Humvee e-tool. So that is the basic. If you just ordered the basic Mission 91, that's all the stuff you would get. Let's go to the advanced. Advanced, here we go. A feather, the Phoenix feather. Now I did not cut the tape on this one, so go ahead and cut the tape with a knife to get to the knife. This is a super feather light neck knife. Are you here? All right. Here we go. What do you got? And let's see. Yes, indeed. Oh, it's razor, razor shaving sharp, razor shaving sharp. This is the Phoenix Feather, and it uh, comes in a Kydex pouch. It has a belt clip on it, or you could take 550 cord and hang it around your neck and make it a neck knife. There you go, from Phoenix. The Phoenix uh, Feather Light from Outdoor Elements. So there you go. That's what you get if you got the advanced box. So you get all the previous stuff plus the Phoenix knife, the Phoenix Feather Outdoor Element, all right? Next, if you get the Pro, so we got Basic Advanced Pro, the Walker's Game Ears right here, Walker Game Ears Patriot Series. And well, I shouldn't have put that knife away, I'll get my pocket knife out here, cut away from me. There we go. Open these up. I've used Walker Game Ears for, well, several years now, I don't know, decades or whatever, and uh, they just keep getting better and better. Uh, it even says Battle Box on it, how cool is that? How cool is that? So these are Walker's Electronic Game Ears, and they come with the Moto patches. We got our little, our Punisher Moto patch there that we can stick on the side. Then we have our American flag that we can stick in their side. And always remember, the stars go forward. The stars go forward. And there we go. Oh, ta-da. And they came with batteries that I just dropped on the floor that I'm not going to pick up right now. Uh, the nice thing about the new modern Walker game ears is uh, you can add accessories to them, like uh, portable radios and so forth. So there we go. The battle box. These, the model here is the Patriot Series Razor Slim Earmuffs. I bet you these will fit perfectly underneath a, an, a, an OTE helmet. There we go. So there we go. All right, next. What's last? Last, but certainly not least, on the uh, Mission 91 is the Outdoor Element Phoenix Talon Knife. This is a bigger knife, and I can feel that it's much heavier already get this guy out here all right yes this is a beefy knife right here this is a beefy solid blade right there all right and what do we got on this let's let's read the descriptor the descriptor of that so I'll, I'll read it from right here. All right, it says that it has a gut hook, which obviously it does. It has a big full belly. It has a full tang D2 steel. Uh, and of course, it has a Kydex sheath, which has a belt clip. Let's go ahead and get a screwdriver and take this off. There it is, see that? See that right there? You liking that? You liking the way that looks? All right, just got myself a flathead screwdriver. Now in the field, we definitely do not want to be losing, we do not want to be losing our screws. So we got to be cautious. I would probably take the towel, take that towel, and I would, if I was in the field, and I would lay it down. Okay, all right, so, so it has a hollow center, which, which shows on here that you could, if you wanted to, put fishing line or mini compass or fishing hook. So there you go. This is the uh, Phoenix Talon and the gut hook is also uh, replaceable. 
You can replace the gut hook if you need to, if you've worn it out. You do dress elk or what have you. So there you go. That is the Battle Box Mission 91. Lots of good gear from basic all the way up to the Pro, Pro Plus level. I hope you enjoyed this unboxing video. And uh, if you go to Battle Box, tell them the student of the gun sent you. I'm Paul Markle. Remember, you're a beginner once, a student for life.